Welcome to the short lesson on how to build your own website using Google Sites. To get to this, you have to log into your Google, Google Webmail and you'll see a link called Sites. Click on Sites. You'll see a few sites I've made below. We're going to make one from scratch. So click Create New Site. You need to think of a name. I'm going to call this one Example. When I click over here, it tells me what my URL is going to be. This is what you're going to see uh, in the address bar in whatever browser you're going to use. For site categories, I'm going to call this Computer Applications. And for site description, this is a website for computer applications. So move down a bit. You can see that you can have your site set up so everyone can see it or you can invite people to see it. You can have it as private as you want. I'm going to choose charcoal for the theme. You can choose whatever theme you want. There's actually more themes. When I click create site, it is going to very quickly show me what I have so far. Now for this lesson, we're just going to make one quick page. And the page we're going to make is an about me page. About me. Or you can just click about or type about. I'm going to click create page. And here's our new page. You're going to want to have some text, something telling people who are going to view the site about you. I've already copied, copied some text, so I'm just going to paste it in. Now we need to find an image. And I have selected an image and put it on the desktop. So I'm going to click Insert, Image. I'm going to browse for that image. I named it Headshot. And this is the wonderful headshot that we got for our school IDs. Not my first choice in images, but that's fine. Click Add Image. Awesome. All right, it's a little large. So I'm going to click on Medium. A little bit better. At this point, you can actually change a few more things. When you click on the image, you can change the location. It can be a line left, center, or right. Change the size of small, medium, large, or original. Text wrap is currently off. You can change it on. This will allow the text to wrap around the image. For right now, I'm going to keep it as is. You can, you can change your own settings to where you like them. So I'm done, for right now at least. So I'm going to click Save. It is saved. So that's how you create a new page. But if you notice on the left-hand side, it does not show up in the normal navigation bar over here. So I'm going to click on Edit Sidebar. I'm going to scroll down a little. Click on Edit. And it doesn't show up here either. So we need to click Add Page to Sidebar. And we're going to click on the About Me page. OK. I also don't like the order. I'd rather have Site Map at the bottom. So I'm going to move About Me up. Click OK. Save Changes. Preview. And there we have it. We have our new site, and we've created a page, and we can keep going at this point. I'm going to have future lessons telling you or showing you how to do different different things with Google Sites. Uh, but for now, uh, that's it. Nice job.